chapter 17 My spirit is consumed, my days are extinct, the grave is ready for me. Surely there are mockers with me, and mine eye abideth in their provocation. Give now a pledge, be surety for me with yourself. Who else is there that will strike hands with me? For you have hid their heart from understanding, therefore shalt you not exalt them. He that denounces his friends for the sake of flattery, even the eyes of his children shall fail. He hath made me also a byword of the people, and I am become one in whose face they spit. Mine eye also is dimmed by reason of vexation, and all the members are as, and all my members are as a shadow. Upright men are astonished at this, and the innocent stirreth up himself against the godless. Yet the righteous holdeth on his way, and he that hath clean hands waxes stronger and stronger. But as for you all, do you return, and come now, and I shall not find a wise man among you. My days are past, my purposes are broken off, even the thoughts of my heart. They change the night into day, the light is short because of darkness. If I look for the netherworld as my house, if I spread my couch in the darkness, if I had said to corruption, you art my father, to the worm, you art my mother and my sister, where then is my hope? And as for my hope, who shall see it? They shall go down to the bars of the netherworld, when we are at rest together in the dust. All right, let's go back up to verse 1. You know, yesterday Job was answering Eliphaz and calling out to God at the same time. You know, because of these ones that were sent there, these sorry comforters, Job calls them. Just got a lot of words, a lot of speech. They, they're they accusing Job of being a sinner. They're accusing Job of transgression, even though Job Job is not done. No, nothing. These, we'll find that the trials of the flesh, these things that fall upon us, these, these things are uh, of the flesh. They have nothing to do with God or the great this the great punishment or judgment of God. The the judgment is viewed in a different way, and it's viewed through the eyes of understanding that we have uh, the the. These these things that they're made known obviously we can see. But anyway, these men had, had accused Job of sinning. These men ain't of great understandings. They their, their understanding is only that which they've been given by men. But Job is asking God to to forgive, to have mercy upon the man, uh, upon on the flesh. To have mercy, uh, to forgive a man if a man has uh, contended with God, uh, let there be uh, to be forgiveness. Let him be able to turn and, and say, "Hey, I'm sorry. Forgive me." Just like if a neighbor had committed an act or a trespass against you, maybe thrown something trashy, and you don't just get angry. The, the neighbor uh, may be in a may, in ignorance of what he's done. May not even know he done it may not have no understanding and there's no sense in coming against him with great anger when we can just make known and there's there's forgiveness there see there's forgiveness and we can just ask our neighbor that you know and tell him he has uh, upset us and maybe this would be enough but contention has a way of growing But Job has recognized now that he has come near his death, and he has asked God to, to forgive him. Be, to, to forgive him, he would forgive his neighbors if they had done something. Verse one: My spirit is consumed; my days are extinct. The grave is ready for me. My spirit, even my understandings, are consumed. These, uh, God is is taking away, uh, and my days, my days are. My days are these these smaller things that I've known, all these uh, cycles that are to come, these lesser cycles even that are to come. The days are extinct. They're about over. The grave is ready for me. It's about time to die. Job is in great peril, too. Surely there are mockers with me, and mine eye abideth on their provocation. Surely there are mockers. These mockers here, the word is, 
uh, should be deceivers. There are deceivers with me, and mine eye abideth on their provocation. And this word provocation should be their rebellion. I can see their rebellion. Three, give now a pledge. Be surety for me with yourself. Who else is there that will strike hands with me? Now give now a pledge. That's a promise. Give now a, a word of, uh, that has a base, uh, has a foundation. Be surety. See, be surety for me with yourself. With God, may God be, be the surety uh, in your understandings. Because who else is there? that will strike hands with me and to strike hands with me is to be in this agreement to make an agreement with me and we'll find out that agreement was a covenant even from the beginning with humanity a covenant saying it was a very simple covenant follow me keep my law keep my understandings for for you have hid their heart from understanding therefore shall you not exalt them for you have hid their heart you have hid their inner understanding from this understanding from that because it's the law the law and god has hid your your thoughts from the law therefore you shall not god shall not exalt them and this this word exalt here is to lift up to raise up there'll be no raising you up because you you not you've not sought after god's understanding the understanding that god give you even in the beginning it's already in your heart Five, he that denounces his friends for the sake of flattery, even the eyes of his children shall fail. He that denounces his friends uh, for the sake of flattery. And if we went to the King James Version here, uh, King James Version uh, is going to say, he that speaks flattery to his friends, even the eyes of his children shall fail. And these, this word here speaketh, it it's announces, it is announced, not denounced, but announced, and because why this word flatteries? This word flatteries is a portion. It's a it's that which is smoothed out. It's these, it's the sweet words. Or it's the what I call the cookies and the Kool Aid that goes with it. It's it's that unneeded portion. It's that sweetness within it. It's not needed. It's these flatteries. It's the it's the goodness of it. It's it's see it's the lies. It's the deceptions even. And even the eyes of his children shall fail. Why? Well, that's those that come forth from him. Those that they, these things that they look upon, or these things that they expect, these things that they hope for in their expectations, it's going to fail. Six, he hath made me also a byword of the people. I am become one whose face they spit. He hath made me also a byword of the people, like something that's not said no more. It's like a word that's not used. And I am become one in whose face they spit. And this is one they have no respect for. They spit at. They look down upon it. Of course, that's his name, Job. This one that's hated. This one that's spit at. They, nobody likes him. He's looked down upon. Why? Well, they, they think God's punishing him. They think he's a sinner and nobody's. he won't repent of his ways. But we'll find out. Job has done nothing wrong. Seven. Mine eyes also is dimmed uh, by reason of vexation, and all my members are as a shadow. Mine eye, these things I expect, these things I look forward to, is dimmed. It's darkened even by the reason of vexation, uh, by these troubles even, these, these, these troublings that I'm put through even those of flesh and all my members are as a shadow and these all my members are that that of my body these my body is fading it's like it's like it's 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 withering it's withering it's going away these and those days of my great strength are but a shadow they are passing away the upright men are astonished at this and the innocent stirreth up himself against the godless upright men upright man upright man is somebody who stands up before god they've quit crawling in the earth they stood up they faced the judgment they took it on and they stood up they are astonished at this and this uh or i believe the king james version says astonished uh but uh amazed jaw dropper they are stupefied 
They are stupefied by this. And the innocent, those stir up themselves against the godless. And the godless are those, the innocent are those that um, are, are without guilt. They, are, they have no guilt. They stir themselves up against the godless, and these godless are the hypocrites. These, these that say, oh, you have to do this or you have to do that, and then they do it not. See, these are the hypocrites, and they make themselves known with their own tongue. Their own life speaks clearly to themselves. They don't have the ability to, to judge themselves. Nine, yet the righteous hold us on his way, and he that hath clean hands wax stronger and stronger. Yet the righteous, that's those that stand before God. See, the just, those that have been justified by the law. Uh, when the law, when you put yourself under the law, see, or you are justified by it. You make yourself right by it. Uh, a wise man does meditate in it day and night. They hold on their way, and he had that has clean hands. His wax is stronger and stronger. That's because he's washed his hands. He's made his hands clean. His works are clean. That what he does. He is obedient to the law or observant to the law. He has clean hands. That's what it means, and he waxes stronger and stronger. His strength only gets grows. Why? Well, he sees these things. They are made known to him, and he only gets stronger and stronger. Ten. But as for you all, do you return? And come now, and I shall not find a wise man among you. But as for you all, of course, Job, he was speaking to those that were sitting there before him. Do you return? Are you are you coming back? Are you in your return? If you are, then come now. He's, come now. We'll see. I shall not find a wise man among you. There will not be one who has greater, great understanding among you. See, be wise. We'll, we'll find out. God gives us all an equal portion. Uh, an equal portion in the beginning even. And it's in your heart. It's in your understanding. God put it there. It was for an example, so he could call it as a witness against you even in the end. But there's none that has wisdom. There's none that will use it. See, and the, what wisdom is to use your understanding, to use your knowledge, see, to be observant to the law God put inside of you. See, that's wisdom. 11. My days are past. My purposes are broken off, even the thoughts of my heart. My days are past, uh, these cycles of understanding that well, Job is thinking he's ready to die. My purposes are broken off. These things that I was had reason to do, they have come to an end. They're cut off, and my, even the thoughts of my heart, these hopes, my hope, for they change the night into day, and the light is short because of darkness. But, and that's why these mockers, these deceivers, these liars that are there, they're the ones who are changing the night into today. They're the ones that are calling the darkness light and the light darkness, and they have no understanding, making, th making the good thing an evil and the evil thing the good. It's the same thing, night into day, the positive into the negative into good. Darkness in the day, uh, the night in the day, that would be to, to change that which is evil into good. The light is short because of the darkness. And that, that period of understanding, that period where we can see it's very short because of the darkness, because of their lies, because of their perversions, their, their and it's these deceivers and these mockers that, that we're talking about. 13. If I look for the netherworld as my house, if I spread my couch in the darkness, now if I look for the netherworld as my house, if uh, that's that place of flesh, that's, that's uh, that world below, the nether is below or lower than this world, that world, we, if we are in this world, we look at that as the grave. But if, see, if we're in God's kingdom, it would be this world, see, and they get successfully lower and lower. Of course, the, where is the final, how low is the lowest point? Well, God knows the depths of that. In this netherworld, who, who would make this your house, your abode? Is this where you want to dwell? 
And if I spread my couch in the darkness, or if I make my bed in darkness, and if I to decide that I want to become a thief, or if I decide that I want to become an evil person and use my understanding to do wickedness, see, if I make my bed, that would be I make my bed in life, even in that darkness and that evilness. 14. If I said to corruption, you are my father, to the worm, you are my mother and my sister. And if I would have said to corruption, you are my father, you, from you I will get all my understanding. You have given birth to me, you have brought me forth. And to the worm, that, that, that worketh within, that worketh within, that's what the worm is. You are my mother and my sister. You are the reflection. You, this that works within. You are the reflection of my father, the, his understanding, and my sister. You would share that with me. Fifteen. Where then is my hope? As for my hope, who shall see it? Where then is my hope? Where Where is this hope? This uh, this word this cord even that that is uh lowered down where is my, this hope if i am trapped in this hole uh, where is my my hope who shall lower me a cord down here so i can get out and as for my hope who shall see it even if there was it would be utter darkness and no one could be able to see the, my hope 16 they shall go down to the bars of the netherworld when we are at rest together in the dust. They shall go down to the bars of the netherworld. Well, that's those that have these flatteries, all those that have these this understanding that's closed up in darkness and all it is is of the flesh. else you go down into the bars these bars are these uh, this is that iron this is that iron there in that enclosure of the nether world it encloses there in the nether world these bars uh, these iron iron this iron is the the rules of men these laws these understandings men make in the nether world that place where the grave exists Then we will be at rest together in the dust, and that was the purpose of it. It was, it's actually was a, a, a trap. It's a trap, and there they are enclosed. We are going to move forward to chapter 18. Turn and return.